So this is PJ. Hello. PJ is a very good friend of mine who also has a fantastic page I was talking to you guys about forever ago. Go ahead. Tell them about your page. Tell them about your page. I, they're on my page. Oh, wait. We're putting this on each other's pages. That so that's the, the, that, that like does. Do um, we did this and we're going to put it on both of our did. pages. Oh, my God. I'm so pale. I am. I am literally. I look like uncooked chicken. That's horrible. Ooh. Anyway. I would just like to point out that this girl is a glamazon and always I am looks not gorgeous. A whereas I'm I've not. been at the studio all day and I'm covered in paint. Paint. Lots of paint. I have to put makeup on because if I don't, my face would look like this. Do you like it? It would be this white. Can we talk about the fact that for both of us to be in the screen, mm -hmm. you can only get half of us? I know. Wait, there we go. <gasps> we need a camera person. Oh, Ellen could do it. A okay. camera person. <laughs> Hold that. Oh. Or, or, oh, whoa. whoa. That's no, way that too far. No, it sounds so bad. There okay, we go. there we go. Okay, there we go. Hi. Okay. Hi. <laughs> Wait, disembodied uh, camera person. There we go. That's good. You just want your boobs on camera. I do. They are good. They're better than mine. I'm not going to lie. Turn back time. Anyway, so I have a page. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Mary Beth McCarthy, and I have a page called Fattress. And it is it was supposed to be a daily uh, vlog thing about trying to lose weight and how uh, it's very fun and very hard and very awful. Blech. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. I, I ain't got time for that. And I'm like, I should update this. And then a week or a month or whatever goes by. I'm currently in a bet with my father to lose 50 pounds by Christmas. I have 36 more pounds to lose in the next three and a half months. PJ's turn. Mm, my page is much less exciting. It's PJ Vote Fat and Funny. It's funny. And I post like three times a day. And it's funny. Yeah. Well, it's, it's, it's sometimes and I get it. It's in the name. Yeah. yeah. I put yeah. it out there right What's there. in the name? Fat um, and funny. So basically I'm trying to lose 100 pounds. I'm 30 pounds down since the beginning of June when I gave up eating wheat and sugar. So despite the fact that my face is red, like I've been like freebasing sugar that's just because we just finished a rehearsal and i'm all like <laughs> harry potter <laughs> by the way come see harry potter this weekend yes Thursday you'll Friday. hear me belt it's great I yes belt. she belts and if you miss it you'll be a poor unfortunate soul you oh ah! see, see what i did there yes yeah. now now let's get back okay to the point. We anyway have a, back we, to, we, had a, we had a topic we planned this and everything so yeah here is our topic mm -hmm. um my boyfriend is currently also losing weight and is on a health journey to you know be healthier and great stuff. everybody should be healthier. yes here's the difference between my boyfriend losing weight and me losing weight Here's, here's my boyfriend. I'm going to give up soda. <laughs> mm. Here's Mary Beth. I'm going to give up soda. And food. And more food. That's not fair. What the hell? Yeah. So our angst, our problem, is the fact that it's, it's, it's desperately harder for women to lose weight than men. Yes. Men sneeze and lose five pounds. Yeah. I watch you eat a quarter pounder with cheese and gain 17. Yeah. It's, not, it's not fair. Like a week after my sister and I quit eating wheat and sugar, uh, we were going somewhere, and my husband looked over at me and was like, I've lost 10 pounds. <laughs> Seriously? I love you, T, but... Ooh. La, 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 I can't put it on my page if you say that. I didn't. I said, fa, la, 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 la. Okay. Mm -hmm. My mom reads my page. Oh, hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. <laughs> my mom <Yeah>. gave up. <laughs> so, <laughs> my mom didn't. <laughs> no, seriously, though. I mean, he wasn't even eating it. Like, one... One meal out of the day, he was eating the way we were eating. The rest of the time, he was eating everything he wanted to, and he just dropped 10 pounds. Mm -hmm. That sucks. It's not fair. No. And I think that sometimes guys don't realize that it's harder for us. Like, they just assume that if we did what they did, it would just be like, yeah. I love weight. Yeah. Oh, we're so pretty. Weird. You know what I find funny, though? When you lose weight in your boobs, they notice that. Oh, what happened? <laughs> Because let's face it, ladies. Well, when you lose weight. Yep. It's usually it's right here and right here first. Yeah. I yeah. lose it in my butt and boobs. I don't lose it in my butt. I have a butt the size of Nova Scotia. And it's hanging on for dear life. I've always wanted to visit Nova Scotia. <laughs> <laughs> I heard the ice cream is wonderful. <laughs> I'm sorry. It just was like perfect. It was like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> now, actually, this is an interesting okay. aside. Mm -hmm. okay. I, I read a I read an article today about how Nova Scotia is offering people money and land if they move there. And ice cream. And ice cream. Are you I, offering people money and land if they I, move to your butt? I might. <laughs> <laughs> yes. You can land. Wait. Okay. Woo. Off, yeah. topic. Off topic. So anyway, mm -hmm. uh, this is just a little glimpse, basically venting our frustrations about the fact. And men do think that. And men are like, I don't understand. Why are you not losing weight? I don't know what it is. I'm sure if I actually researched it and looked up body chemistry and all that bull shalaka, I would understand. 
I'm trying real hard here. Appreciate <laughs> it. Bullshit. So does my mother. Thank you. My mom. Um, my mom's like, well, I'll do it for her mom and you won't do it for me. <laughs> but it's, I'm sure if I looked it up, you can find the logical reasoning, the logical, the logic yeah, it's, behind it's, it. It's hormones yeah. and chemistry. But it's like kind of, you know, don't we deal with enough? Don't Does it also have to be like, oh my God, I'm going to get into a whole male privilege thing. Let's here. not oh, do yeah. need to do no. that. This is a but funny seriously, place. Seriously. It is a funny place. Yes. But it's like, you get everything already. Can we oh, please just lose weight? Yeah. Yeah. There, there. So yeah, that's basically what we're talking about. Yes. So men, if men. you got a woman mm-hmm. who's got a little extra loving, which is never a bad thing, mm-hmm. and she's frustrated, don't be like, well, just don't eat. Don't ever. Nope. Ever. I dated. Don't do it. Two different people who did that. No. Here's, here's the thing I've learned, and this is going to pop up in another thing I'm working on. If they don't love you when you're fat, they're not going to love you when you're skinny either. Mm-mm. Believe nope. me, I know from so much experience that this is true. This is something I'm still actually trying to learn for mm-hmm. myself. But it's absolutely true. Yeah. And I know this is a hard thing for me because everybody always says, lose weight for yourself, do it for yourself, do it for your health. I wish I could say that I've always done that. That would be a blatant lie. And I've always said I would never lie on this. You know, I've tried to lose it for people. I tried to get them to love me more because I'd be skinnier. And I did. And I lost 50 pounds once in like four months, I think. Mm. It was from that, you know, crippling depression. Whatever. Mm. It happened and not eating. And that is the thing that somebody I had dated after had been like, oh, you lost all this weight before. I'm like, yeah, Mm -hmm. that was great. That whole one shake I had a day with some lettuce. That was, that was good. Being healthy is more important than anything else. Because look, did, did I stay a size eight? Unless you actually do it correctly, and PJ is doing it absolutely correctly, you make a lifestyle change. It's what you have to do. You know, I have a friend who lost, I think he's lost over 100 pounds now, and he actually portions all his food. He does everything. It's not just this, you don't lose like 15 pounds. No, it can't be. When I leave here, I'm going home to do my food prep for the week. Mm -hmm. Gotta hard boil some eggs, gotta cook some chicken, gotta cook some vegetables, gotta put it in the containers and get ready to go. Because someone who shall remain nameless has me a rehearsal every single day until Friday. I'll bring you cucumber sandwiches. Yeah. Cucumbers with cucumber inside. A cucumber yes. with a cucumber. It's, it's a cucumber <laughs> I'm <section>. a chef. <laughs> I'm a chef. So anyway, this yes. is two girls. Mm-hmm. Fatress. Mm-hmm. Fat and funny. Mm-hmm. You can find us. Yep. We do things. We do things we like We talk this. about things. Mm-hmm. And if you'd ever like us to talk about anything else or banter just for the fun of bantering, let us know because as you can tell, we enjoy hearing ourselves <laughs> It's so true. It's so true. Oh. That's our that's our camera person, who's her twin sister, holding the phone, going yes, yes, yes. <laughs> bye, guys. Right, bye. <laughs>